Negative. I'll protect him from himself. I'll clean things up and get rid of the sissies who are using him. Wimpy hamburger devouring civilians who don't have the balls to grab a machete and cut the bull's head off. What the heck? This country was founded by generals, by soldiers. Calm down, little soldier. I'm with you. As long as you keep paying me what we agreed, that is. Tarantula, I got some news. We think that spy is around here, in the camp. The signal ain't clear, but we're trying to zero in on him. Damn that two-bit civilian. Mobilize everyone. Let no one sleep until we catch him. Ha! He's walked into the wolf's den. No doubt about it. He's in cahoots with that parachute girl. Gina! So don't repeat the same mistake as this morning. She jumped out over the lake. She had to be eliminated. She should have been captured and interrogated. Well, you can just forget about her. The underwater camera recorded footage of the girl sinking to the lake bottom. She's not talking to anyone anymore. No, it can't be. Gina can't be dead. No way. My experience tells me she isn't so easy to get rid of. She got shot by some Mafia thugs and managed to escape. And I myself ran over her with my car on accident. And once again she escaped the grips of death. She even fell into a really deep well. And she hardly scraped her leg. And now... Well, maybe I'm wishing on a star here, but Joshua says that the alien spacecraft is at the bottom of the lake. And considering the way things stand... Maybe what he said is true. It seems nuts, but I think my only way out is to help him find Professor Simon. Gina doesn't deserve for me to give up. I'll have to act carefully, however. If I heard things right, they think I'm a spy and they're hot on my trail. And don't mess up again, doll. Don't be afraid of him, my little fridges. The day I grow tired of him, <laughs> you'll see. Oh, you're all so lovely. Angelina, Agostina, Andrina, Agrippina, Alexandrina, Alfonsina, and Adelina. You, where is Adelina? Uh, I don't know anyone named Adelina. Amateurs, I stop for one second to speak with a colonel and you lose a 20-inch long tarantula. Poor Adelina. It was 13's fault. Hey, I didn't do nothing wrong. 18 did it. Fire, it was 17. Uh-uh, it was... You, for instance. Ugh! She was a second dry. She hardly even scratched the dude. I could see it coming. I told you those finely manicured nails contain a paralyzing venom underneath. What? Do you copy? Forget about that food for my pretties. I just came across 180 pounds of feed, but it's too fresh for their weak stomachs. You know what to do. Hey, I thought spiders ate insects. Normally they do, but these have been raised on decomposed flesh. The worse it smells, the better. Silence, or you will be accompanying Seventeen. That's the girl I almost ran into the first time I came into the camp. Who'd have guessed she's a grade-A psychopath? I better hurry up and escape through the amoeba, or I may not live to tell this whole story. This must be the Tiki Temple everyone keeps mentioning, though. What I don't get is what the heck that huge metal arena is for. With that circular structure and the size, it almost looks like a coliseum. And it's surrounded by men in black like the ones from before. So something important must be hidden inside. Hmm. Probably that John Doe. I wonder who that guy is. This is all so weird. Okay, Mr. They're watching it too closely for it to be something unimportant. So it couldn't be anything less than the mess hall. being prepared a cephalothorax looking good delicacy. Moron. Now that is one whacked statue. And I don't just mean the head. No, they might catch me. From what I've heard, she's a salary-earning mercenary helping Kordsmeyer with some dirty business. I'll see you later, one. They say tarantula venom isn't deadly, but why put that theory to the test? 
Plus, I bet these have been genetically engineered to become more lethal. It looks like it has clothes in it. A uniform, perhaps? Not very discreet, by the way. This may just be a coincidence, but the palms of those gloves remind me of the palms of those catalyzing gloves I wrecked. You're famished, aren't you? Ooh, ooh, imagine this! They're watching it too closely for it to be something unimportant. So it couldn't be anything less than the mess hall. Absurd. You're not saving your country, you're just a mercenary paid by a murderer. None of them really look like soldiers. Impossible. You love Seventeen. <laughs> just wait and see. Any further news about the... This bag is so strong, I'd be surprised if the tarantula could gnaw its way out. Well, if I do this right, it won't even come in contact with my fingers. Let's hope she's still asleep. Got her! Those holes I made with the probe should keep Adelina from suffocating. Here goes. Have you finished, number one? Yes, Tarantula. I'll take the bits and pieces up to the roof. With all this sun, they should be ready in just a few days. Remember, it has to smell truly vile in order for my pretties to devour it like gluttons. Hmm, they're just particular that way. And remember, once you find that spy, get everyone looking for Adelina. Yes, ma'am. Tarantula. Did you hear that, my pretties? You'll soon get a waft of that pungent odor that drives you mad. And then you'll have a true feast. You'll just have to be patient a little bit longer. Of course, the Calm spider down. will run out. Tarantula will follow it. I can go grab the glove. Wait, what am I saying? How could I be sure the spider won't make a beeline for the terrarium? Darn, I'd better forget it. Weren't the apostles... There were... Let's hope the old rule that everything that goes up must come down works as always. And, uh, Great idea. If I put the bottle in the right spot, I can get that aromatic rotten beef smell to drift over to the Tiki Temple. Yes. You saw what happened at 17. Oh, God. I have to ask I won't be able to get beyond this point without being caught. Okay. I'll open the bottle and hide it inside this crack. Crap! Typical. That's what the other 12 did. 
Okay, forget I said anything. This bottle's so old, I can twist it open. I'll have to put the creative juices to work. Yeah, that one on the right will help me get some leverage to twist off the lid. Oh man, disgusting. For once, an advertising slogan that doesn't lie. This could raise the dead. If I hadn't closed the lid right away, it would have knocked me out. So now that I managed to open that thing, it's time to put my plan to the test. Since we're all wearing uniforms and goggles, I can fool Tarantula if I tell her I'm 37, can't I? Impossible. A lack of experience can be smelled a mile away. Perfect. Nobody saw me. Hey, what's that stench? Ugh, it's revolting. <laughs> yeah, if you even hint it was me, I'll pound you on the head. Hilarious. The smell made it all the way to the temple. It's working. Sure, that plan should work, and Adelina will run in the right direction. Even I can smell where that icky stench is all is emanating from. Let's just cross our fingers and hope everything works out. Come on, Adelina. Use that keen sense of smell and head for that aromatic delight. Hey, a spider! Adelina! Stop her! Yikes! She crawled into that hole. Move out of my way, you amateurs. Now's the time. I better hurry if I don't want those goons to catch me down there. Adelina, my lovely, 